Previously on Phoenix Wright. How can you not know the great s <laughs> And now there's more. Okay, let's get out of here. Main gate. Oh, she's back! Aha! You again! <laughs> How rude, acting like you've seen a ghost. A ghost. You certainly got back to your post quickly. Oh, the police took me away, they did. They pulled out a spare steel samurai costume, told me to put it on. Can you imagine? How could I, a sweet little old lady, wear a giant suit like that? Mr. Powers is pretty tall. As soon as they saw there was no way I could wear it, they let me go. I guess that would rule out her being the murderer. Anyway. Know this, whippersnapper. This old lady never forgets a slight or insult. And you won't get any information out of me. My lips are sealed. You sure are talking a lot for someone with sealed lips. Starting now. One, two, three. This lady's too much. Alright, there's really no use talking to her if she's not gonna say anything. But you know what? We'll try, because the option's there. Um, about that kid you said you saw. If I see him again, I'm taking him down. N Nick, look at her eyes. She's serious. About the director, the one who was here on the day of the murder. If I see him again, I'm taking him down. Okay. Well. Okay then. Uh, Studio One. Maybe Studio Two again. I need the key so I can go in. Security guard station. I can see the computer that runs the security cameras. Hey, no touching. Guess I'd better investigate there later. Ugh, fine. October 18th, detention center. Visitor's room. Oh, Mr. Wright, thank you for earlier. Not at all. We got lucky to tell the truth. You can say that again. Let's not. So, WP. Do you have any leads that might get us going in the right direction? Mm, sorry, but no. Be sure to tell us anything that comes to mind, no matter how small. We can't rely on getting lucky again tomorrow. Y yes. The fanboy. Do uh, fanboys sneak into these studios often? No, not that I heard of. That security lady's pretty strict with them. But in today's testimony, didn't she say they were often hanging around? Kids really, really love the Steel Samurai. They sneak past when she's not looking, I guess. Director. Was the director present at the morning run-through? Yes. Yes, he was. He was directing how the Steel Samurai and the evil magistrate should move. Why didn't you tell us that before? Well, just the studio asked us to keep quiet. That has nothing to do with this! I hate to repeat myself, but Nick here is a newbie lawyer, fresh off the bar. You're gonna get a guilty sentence, cause that's how much he sucks. When he loses, he's going to lose big. <laughs> I... I see. Whose side is she on? You aren't hiding anything else from us, are you? N no I sure hope not. All right, let's stop grilling him. <sighs> Whoa! Hey! Hey, wait! I'll bet he came in right through that drain. Oh, it's a good thing we opened it! Uh, hey, um, kiddio. What's your name, sport? <laughs> Not a kid, so don't talk to me like that. Uh huh. But you, you are a kid. What a rude little brat. There's no way to talk to an adult. That's no way to talk to an adult. I don't see no adults here, hippie fashion chick. H hippie fashion. Nick, I think I'm being mocked. You got to hand it to Maya. She's pretty sharp and pretty mad. I'm Cody. Cody Hackins. Call me kitty -o again, and I'll cut your damn throat! Wow, this guy is intense. Steel Samurai. So you're a friend of the Steel Samurai? How 
dare you utter that name, evildoer? What do you mean? We're on the Steel Samurai side! Ha ha! Ha ha! You can't fool me! Okay, then what's the last line said by the innkeeper in episode 8? Ha! Easy! Like some fries with that! <laughs> Not bad, Kiddio! Watch it! What are they doing? <laughs> God! Okay, what happened? Say, you heard anything about the incident the other day? Hmm. You were here, weren't you? Did you see anything? He... He... Hmm? He... Always... The Steel Samurai always wins! Always! Yeah, I saw him! I saw everything! What?! B but no way I'm telling you, you losers! What? Wait! Let me go! He's gone. Huh? Something fell off the table when he bumped into it on his way out. A bottle? Why was this sitting there, I wonder? Empty bottle. The label reads sleeping pills. Yo! Big UPS truck just passed by, but other than that... Yo! Will Powers! I bet he was drugged. X. Anyway. What was that kid saying? He saw everything. Dude, we need that kid back. Studio main gate? Huh? Where's that old windbag? Out of her to leave her post. Hey! Nick? That was her! S stop With her snapper! G yeah, sounds like she's chasing after that boy. Natch! Uh-oh, she tripped! Maya sure looks happy. <laughs> oh, now's our time to get the keys. H hey, hey, Nick. Now's our chance. Let's check out the guard station. Good idea. Oh, this is it, Nick. The trailer key. The key to that trailer in Studio 2. We'll be borrowing this, right, Nick? Uh-huh. Definitely. There are some fishy... How are we... How did the detectives miss all this? Did they just not interrogate anyone? They were just like, yeah, we're here. Let's not ask questions. Alright. Studio 2. Oops. Uh, examine... Do we have to look at the door? I wonder if the key we borrowed from the guard station will work. It opened. Great! Let's go, Nick! She seems eager all of a sudden. Well, you first, Nick! Uh, not that eager. <laughs> oh, this is... I feel like we're in danger if we do this. Let's go. October 18th, Studio 2 trailer. Oh, hello. Eek! S someone's in here! Names... Uh, our n names? Um, we're WP's lawyers, and, um, I see. And who might you... D. Vasquez, the producer. Oh, hello. D. Vasquez, she's quite beautiful. She is. Uh, let's talk. I was wondering if you could tell me about the day of the murder. Miss Vasquez? Script. I excuse me? Script. I'm looking for a script. A script? The Steel Samurai, episode 13. I need it. Um, could we ask you a bit about the day of the murder? I need to read it. We're getting nowhere fast. Uh, yeah, we are. What's wrong with you? Um, we'd really like to ask you about the Steel Samurai. Miss Vasquez? It's on TV every week. That's all I have to say about that. Nick, she's telling us to go watch TV? The nerve of her! Hey, don't get mad at me. About the director, Sal Manella, was it? What, uh, exactly is his role here? 
Perhaps I didn't make myself clear. I'm looking for a script. I can't be bothered with anything else. Nick? Are all people in the entertainment business this weird? Starting to look like it. Nick, let's get out of here. Isn't there someplace else we have to check? Y yeah. Wait. Y yes? If you see Manila, give him this. Why do we have to do your errands? I... I don't think I like her. <laughs> don't cry. She'll take it as a sign of weakness. Alright. We'll give it to him if we see him. Bring me the script for episode 13. Really? She was- she gave us nothing. She just gave us an errand. Maybe if we do it, she'll talk. Ah, uh, yeah. Welcome back! Uh, we have to present it to him. Here you go. Take that! Here, I got this from the producer. Huh? Bring me the script for episode 13. Episode 13? Where did I put that one? I must have left it somewhere. <laughs> Uh, uh, uh oh, my ass is pwned if I don't find it. <laughs> I don't really want to think about your ass getting pwned, Manella. Nick, it might be quicker to just look in all the places where he's likely to have been. I agree. Oh my goodness! You really gotta find a script. Is that it? It's a bunch of snacks on the table. Hey, Nick! What now? The, the snacks! There was twice as much here before! Uh, I, uh, I ate them. They were past their expiration date anyway. Rafa. She's biting her lip and staring at me with tears welling in her eyes. Oh, Maya, you're such a sweetheart. Okay. I don't think I'll be able to find it in here. Are we, are we, are we really playing, um, I Spy? Right now. Maybe the Studio One? We're back at the scene of the crime. Let's find what we need and get out of here quick, Nick. Alright, I think I see it, actually. That's it right there. Hey, look! That's the chair the director sits in! I've always wanted to sit in one of these. A director? Maya, take a look around that chair for me, would you? Remember that script the director was talking about? Didn't he say he left it somewhere? Aha! Found it, Nick! The script! Good work. Script place in pocket. It looks grimy and gross. Alright. I'm not even going to Manila. I just I just wanna go to um What's her face? Here's your script. Here's your script. Here, we found it. Your script. Ah. Script handed to D. Vasquez. Um. Uh. You're not going to talk to us? Quiet. I'm reading. <laughs> Just you hold on! What's the big idea? Who do you think you are, anyway? And and do you even know who we are? Maya, you sound really... uptight. You sound really... privileged. Powers is lawyers. Um, right. Am I a suspect? N no, it's just, well, no, but... You wanted to know about the day of the murder? Y yes, anything you could tell us would be a big help. You know, there was a meeting here at noon. Yes, with the director and the people from the network. Correct. Now listen closely. None of the people in this trailer that afternoon went to Studio One. It was impossible for us to leave. Impossible? Why? The path was blocked. The path? Why did it bring me into this menu? Let's talk. On the day of the murder, the path that leads here was blocked? You saw Mr. Monkey on the way here, correct? 
Mr. Monkey? The monkey with the broken head. Oh, right. That. What an original name. His head fell over in the wind on the day of the murder. They didn't start moving the head out of the way until after three. It was after four by the time the path was unblocked. Capiche? Everyone in this trailer was stuck here until the path was cleared. Stuck in this trailer. Stuck until after four. Hammer died at 2.30. Thus, none of us could have gone to Studio One. What? It's true. Why is she so, like, like, she knows all these facts, and she has just a convenient alibi. It's just really suspicious. A crane came just after three to move the head. We called some people in to clear the way. I'm sure they'd corrobor corroborate my story. But wait! What if the head fell over after 2.30? Then you could have gone to Studio One. 2.30, the time of death. Very well. Come. It's Mr. Monkey. When it wasn't broken, it announced the time. Ooks. One ook per hour. Ook, 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 ook. Always with the ooking. This is so stupid. <laughs> what is with the... Uh... Vital pieces of evidence with time like it's always something stupid like first it was the thinker and now it's the stupid monkey as a clock It is a monkey after all Check its head the clock inside stopped when it broke hmm? Nick it stopped at 215 215 That's right this path was blocked from 2.15 till after 4, therefore we're innocent. Mr. Hammer died in Studio One at 2.30. See? Goodbye. Okay. What do we do, Nick? There isn't anyone besides WP who could have killed Hammer. It's over. We're finished. It sure doesn't look good. Guess we should head back to the office and plan our strategy. Alright. October 18th, right in Co Law Offices. Now what? We're fresh out of clues. Everyone's alibi is watertight. We don't even have any promising leads. Things are looking pretty grim. It's a little early for giving up, don't you think? I don't know who said that, huh? You've got one lead. Oh! <laughs> I forgot you could do that! M Mia, it's you! What took you so long? Sorry, Phoenix. Maya has trouble calling me unless she's really in trouble. Right. No, oh, wait, I guess that means we're really in trouble. I'd say so. What do you mean we have What do you mean we have one lead? The boy, of course. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I saw him. I saw everything. What? But but no way am I telling you losers. I don't know. He didn't sound like he was going to help us at all. I'm sure you can find some way of bringing him over to your side. Either way, we should go back to the studios. That boy is our last hope, Phoenix. Thanks. Now I'm more worried than I was before. Well, we already... <laughs> We already know what to do. We have to go back and try and find that kid. So much back and forth. October 18th, Global Studios, Main Gate. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm just being extra. What's wrong? <laughs> Whippersnapper! She's been chasing that boy this whole time. <laughs> when, when I c catch him, hi. Sounds like she hasn't had any luck catching him. <laughs> I, I got a hostage now with a snapper. A hostage. A fanboy. Um, what happened to the boy? If I see him again, I'll <laughs> lay him flat. <laughs> My, what a violent old lady. <laughs> Mia's with us! Yes! I'm aboard. I am aboard this. 
Actually, I met with the director just now. Hey. Ha! <laughs> My heart. I don't feel so good. Is she okay? B before I go, I'd like to visit the place where poor Hammer died. Right, she was saying she wanted to visit the studio where he died. Oops. What's this about a hostage? <sighs> when that boy was running away, he dropped this and ran. <laughs> He'll come back. <laughs> For this one. It's kind of hard to understand her with all that huffing and puffing. Phoenix, that hostage might be what we need. Cody might talk to us if we give him that. Good idea. Miss Oldbag, might I- No! I'm catching that brat if it's the last thing I do! Phoenix, do you have anything you might trade with her? A trade, huh? I wonder. Well, we could take her and then, you know, I don't think we have anything in possession. Um, maybe give her the key? Card key for studio- oh, studio- she wants the Studio One employee, so let's give this to her. Hey, that- that's a card. Studio One? Right, a card key to Studio One. I- I could visit poor Hammer. I'd like to visit- he died. Whew. I was his- his fan. You don't have your own card, Miss Oldbag? Studio One isn't my turf. <laughs> You'll let me borrow... borrow it, then? If I give her the card key, then I won't be able to get into Studio One. Uh, well, it's the only way we can get evidence, and plus, I think we got everything we could get, so here. Why don't you let her borrow it, Phoenix? I guess it can't hurt. Here you go, Miss Oldbag. Card key lent to Miss Oldbag. Listen to me, Sonny. I don't like having debts to no whippersnappers. You take this and we're even, deal? What's this? A steel samurai trading card? That sneaky kid dropped it. I figure it's pretty important to him, though. Thank you. I may have a use for this. This must be the hostage she was talking about. Steel samurai cards. Cool. Right, I'm off. There she goes, hobbling off towards the studio. Who's watching this this station? I'm just curious. All right. Um, he's not in Studio One, and he wouldn't be in Studio Two. So going over here would be silly. So let's go to the employee area. October eighteenth, Global Studios employee area. Hey. Hey, you. W wait a second. Phoenix. Was that the boy? Yeah, his name is Cody Hackens. I think he ran into the dressing room. October 18th, Global Studios, dressing room. Be sure to be in here somewhere. Found you! <laughs> Damn it, he's getting away! Come back! There, he's back. How did she? Hey there. Would you mind helping us out? Please. I I'm Cody. Hello, Cody. I'm Mia. Mia Faye. Nice to meet you. Yo! I'm Phoenix Wright. Who asked? <laughs> Come on, Phoenix. You got a busty woman who's being nice to a kid. Of course he's gonna... Phoenix, you can take it from here. I'm not so sure I'm qualified. Steel Samurai. Steel Samurai is so cool. I think he's the, um, the bomb. Ha! <laughs> what would a lamer like you know about the Steel Samurai? Hey, watch the attitude. Phoenix, you really shouldn't yell like that. He's only a kid. Yeah, don't yell like that. I'm only a kid. What happened? So, do you know anything about what happened here? Could you tell me, please? I don't know nothing! Hmm. Looks like a little persuasion's necessary. Maybe a bribe? Alright. Look. You have to come in court, and you have to testify. And you'll get these. I promise. Cody. Does this look familiar? Hey, my you are! 
you are. Huh? You are, you know, ultra rare. That card's really hard to get. Man, for a grown-up, you sure are dumb. I'll give you this if you help me. But that's my card! By offering me something I already own, you're in effect! Es eschewing... Oh god, that's a big word. Eschewing the very basis of our consumer society, namely the principle of fair trade! Man, for a grown-up, you sure are dumb! What do they teach these kids in school these days? Quantum physics? Whatever. I don't need that card. Huh? I got a double. Just keep it. It's yours. What? After I went through all that trouble. If you want to trade, find me a really rare card. Really rare? You mean there's something rarer than ultra rare? Ultra rare premium cards are way rarer than plain ultra rare cards. Come on! Man, for a grown up, you sure are dumb. Premium rare. Why do I feel like we're talking about steaks? <laughs> oh my gosh! Can we just get to the courtroom already, please? I'm out of my league here. Alright. I don't know what to do here. Oops. Oh, wait! No, that's evidence. Give him the spear. I don't know. You want a spear, kid? The samurai spear! That's totally cool! I wish I had one, too. This kid and Maya would get along great. October 18th, Studio 2 trailer. Oh, hi. Hello. What brings you here? Oh, well, I had to arrange some stuff. Um... Yes? The, um, girl with you? Doesn't she seem a little different? Like, is she even the same person as before? Uh, nope. She's the same as always. Same as always. Okay. Whatever you say. <laughs> you have any cards? Have you seen that boy since then? Nope. You missed it, though. The security lady was chasing around after the boy so fast I thought she'd collapse. Of course, he got away in the end. Boy, was she mad. Actually, we saw him. Saw them, sorry. How's the old windbag doing? She was squeezing donuts through her clenched fist back at the guard station. Some people take their jobs a little too seriously. Are all the posters on the wall here a hammer? Yes, it's really a terrible loss for the studios. But his popularity had been waning recently, right? That's true. And then again, after what happened. After what happened? Y you mean, you don't know about Hammer? No, what? I I'm sorry. I shouldn't have said anything. No, tell me. Wait, now you have to tell me. What happened with Hammer? I I'm sorry. I'm probably not the one who should tell you. Uh oh. Why do I get the feeling something's being covered up here? Oh my goodness. Please just tell the truth. Another old movie poster, The Singing Samurai, starring Jack Hammer. What the hell do samurai sing about? Chopping off heads? It's a samurai musical set in ancient Japan. Japan, sorry. Uh, a samurai musical? Is that even a genre? Well, I'm impressed. You know your stuff, Mia. Oh, Maya's a real fan. I just picked a little up. Samurai Summer, starring Jack Hammer. This poster looks like it's been hanging here for years. This is one of Maya's favorite movies. Maybe we should replace the poster in the office with this one? That would be kind of sad. Oh, yeah, it would be. An old movie poster. Dynamite Samurai, starring Jack Hammer. I guess Mr. Hammer used to be quite the star. What's this kelp juice? No clues here. This is where they had that meeting. There are documents and paper cups scattered around. Trash? Nothing in here that would be a clue. Just some paper cups and crumbled documents. Hey, you want these cards? Do you know anything about this? Hey, that's a Steel Samurai trading card! I collect those, actually. I'm one card away from a complete set. A complete set? Yeah, a set of one of each card. Huh. Wait, 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 wait! That's it! That's the card I need! You don't know how long you've been looking for it! 
Uh, I don't care what kind of girl you think I am. I need that card. P please, I beg you, please trade with me. T trade with you? Yes, trade cards. Look, I'll even trade you an ultra rare premium card. Trade me, uh, huh? Yes, it's a good deal for your ultra rare. Please. Phoenix, can't you see she's desperate? What's everybody getting so excited about? Phoenix, we need that card. Jesus. Of course we're gonna trade. Okay. Really? Th thanks. Then this is for you. Oh, great. Yahoo! And there she goes. Doesn't doing good things like that make you feel great? Yeah. Yeah, it does. Alright, so we got her- we got the dumb cards. Here's your stupid card. Here. See this card? Yeah. So- Wait! That's it! That's the last ultra rare premium card I need! Come on, give it to me, please! You gotta give it to me! Wow, I've never seen him so eager. R right. Okay. How about a trade? You're on. I'll give you a samurai spear and throw in an evil magistrate to boot. No, 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 no. Not that kind of trade. I don't want cards. I want information. Huh? You sure? Fine by me. URP card given to Cody. Okay, Phoenix. Let's hear what he has to say. If he knows something that can help us, we can have him take the stand tomorrow. Alright, let's talk. So, you like the Steel Samurai. He's so cool! I... I guess. You're judging him by his looks! You have to look at his actions! At his life! I'm being lectured on life by a grade schooler. You like him too, don't ya? Uh, oh, me? Yeah, I am... love the Steel Samurai. So, tell me about your favorite thing about the Steel Samurai is. Uh... His fighting skills? Yeah. Gotta think of something. I like it when he, uh, he vanquishes his foes. Yeah! Wazam! The Steel Samurai always wins. Always! Check this out. It's my fan album. What the... It's all pictures of the Steel Samurai. <laughs> That's so cute. I go to every live performance. Those stupid publicity stunts where they beat each other up in public. I always take a picture when the Steel Samurai lands the final blow. Wazam! I got them all. I never missed one. A perfect collection. Check it out. My new digital camera. Wow, that's very impressive. The newest model, isn't it? You bet, lady. You got it for my birthday. I Wait, what? You bet, lady. I just got it for my birthday. My album has a name. Wanna hear it? The Steel Samurai. Path to Glory. The Steel Samurai always wins. Always. Hey, if you want this, you can have it, lady. Really? Are you sure? Yeah, I took these with the digital camera. I got all the data at home, so I can always make another one. Well, then I'm happy to accept. Thank you. Path to glory. Yeah, it contains photos of every victory scene and every battle the Steel Samurai has won. What's with people always giving stuff to Mia? What a life. Hmm? You were here on the day of the incident, right? Yeah. Did you see anything unusual? Cody? Hmm. <laughs> Cody, he needs to know because he's fighting for justice. Isn't that the Steel Samurai's motto? For great justice? You have to help us fight for great justice, too. I... I saw... I saw everything. Well, well. We might get some useful information out of him yet. What you saw. Cody, I need to ask you something very important. What did you see on the day of the incident? I got here that day around two. I had to come in through the woods out back so that old lady wouldn't see me. I got kind of lost though. I was in there for maybe a half hour or so. Then I finally got to the studio. After that... What is it, Cody? <laughs> His face. The Steel Samurai killed the bad guy! He used a samurai spear, just like always. One shot, one kill. It happened so fast, I, I got scared. I went home after that. 
I... I see. It must have been hard for you. Man, you say those nice things, but it's so obvious you aren't speaking from the heart. Um, right. Mia? Yes. I think we can say for sure this means the Steel Samurai did it. True enough. And the director has an alibi, so it wasn't him. Indeed. So, the only person left who it could have been is Will Powers. I have to admit, it's kind of a shock. But if you put this boy on the witness stand, your client will be guilty for sure. Let's not call him, then. I think that would be wise. Best to leave this one alone. Not s Oh, is it Detective Gumshoe? Not so p Not so fast, pal. Yes. Except no! He heard everything! <laughs> this boy here's a key witness. And he's under police protection starting now. Come on, son. You've got a rendezvous with me down at the precinct. No, I ain't going! <laughs> me. That didn't go so well. We're back to zero leads. Where did he come from? Did he come through the window? Did no one see the door open? Like, what? Okay, he's a big guy. You can't miss Gumshoe. Huh. And now we have a serious handicap in court. What are we going to do, Mia? Well, hmm. I really need to be going. Don't worry, Phoenix. I'm sure you'll be fine. Whoa, whoa, whoa! C come to the trial tomorrow, please. I need you there. Phoenix, can I ask you something? Do you really believe that Mr. Powers is innocent? Yeah, he's a pushover. Like, look at- he- he- he's so- he's so wimpy. I don't believe he could have killed a guy like that. And he said that, you know, he said that he was telling the truth, so I believe. Of course he is. That's all I wanted to hear. Excellent. I'll see you in court then. Great! Thanks, Mia! <laughs> Except you didn't answer anything! <laughs> see you soon. Continued.